Hey everybody, The Real Deal here. I have got something I'm very excited about. I've got the new Doctor Who Renegade Collection. Finally, I got a case of this. Um, this is, of course, by Titans Vinyl Figures. If you've been watching this channel for a while, you know I love me some Doctor Who. I love these Titans Vinyl Figures. Uh, the Doctor Who Titans Vinyl Figures uh, is what got me started on this channel. It was some of the very first videos I made. So whenever I get a new set of these Doctor Who figures, I'm very excited. And this looks like a pretty cool set. So this is a little different than any uh, than the other Doctor Who sets. There's only 10 figures in the set, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. And this is a set of some of the figures that Titans has been uh, asked about, and a lot of these figures have been fan-requested for years. So this is kind of a set of the figures that have been requested for a long time and that Titans was actually able to do. So we get uh, Professor Lazarus in here, Jenny the Doctor's daughter, Wilf is in here, which is cool, Van Gogh, and the classic Master, which is awesome, uh, and a black and white TARDIS, which is pretty cool. So, And then we've got another 10th and 11th Doctor, and that's cool. We've got plenty of those, though. So I'm excited to get these some supporting characters, especially the Master. I think that's very cool that we're getting a classic Roger Delgado Master figure in here. Uh, I know there are lots of us Titan fans that would love to see more classic Doctor Who figures, um, but when I talk to Andrew Sumner, who's the boss man over at Titans, I, I talk to him every year at New York Comic Con, uh, and he, you know, he brought up a good point. There really isn't a huge market for the classic Doctor Who stuff, uh, especially here in the U.S., so uh, I think they'll kind of sneak these figures in whenever they can of the classic figures, but I don't think we'll ever see a classic Titan Doctor Who set, um, but that's okay. We're getting this cool Roger Delgado Master. So here's the little back uh, display thing, so we'll put that off to the side. So let's see. So I should, um, because there's only 10 figures in here, there's 18 figures in this set here. So I'll probably wind up with uh, just about a double of everything almost, I would think, and uh, at least one of these chases, but I should get the whole set. And of course, poseable arms, oversized head, articulated head. And these are created by UK artist Matt Jones, a.k.a. Lunartic, who does the majority of the Titans figures. And let's check them out here. So, so the only Titans Doctor Who figure I am... Oh, this is for sure a TARDIS. You can feel it. Uh, the only Titans vinyl figure I am missing, and I think probably one of the only ones a lot of other people are missing, is from the last set, there is a super rare Sarah Jane figure. Uh, in a white dress. Yeah, there we go. We've got the black TARDIS. Or the black and white TARDIS, I should say. That's ah, very cool. That goes very well with the black and white First Doctor that they released a few sets ago. And this is 2 and 18, so we'll probably be seeing another one of these. Very, very nice. And there's a TARDIS variant, too, which I think is the Van Gogh TARDIS. I'm pretty sure, so we'll see if I wound up getting that or the Master Chase. But yeah, I'm missing that Sarah Jean in the white dress. It was a super rare figure. Thankfully, Titans is no more, longer doing those super rare and ultra rare figures because they were upsetting everybody with those. Something they decided to try. Uh, the feedback from the fans was not great. So to their credit, I appreciate that they said, OK, well, you know what? The fans don't like it. We're not doing it anymore. And I, I again, those interviews I did with uh, Andrew Sumner at New York Comic Con. Oh, this is another TARDIS. Uh, he kind of went into a little bit of that. So check those interviews out. They're pretty cool. Um, but anyway, if you have one of those Sarah Jane figures and you're interested in getting rid of it, send me a message. Let me know. I'd be interested in negotiating with you because that would complete my collection. Uh, but anyway, there's another black and white TARDIS. Okay, so they're right next to each other. Now, I wonder, a lot of times right in the front here, as you can see, I'm just going from left to right in order. I don't have it on camera, but that's how I'm opening this box, if you want to kind of keep track of where the stuff is. Um, usually, right in the front is where they have the rare figure, which in this case would be one of the 1 in 36 figures. So let's see if that's the case with this, if it's right in the front there. Now, as far as I know, there's no... Oh, yep, we've got the Master... Oh, okay, cool. So I've got the Master Chase figure. So that's it there. Uh, he does not come with any accessory, it looks like. I guess his regular one does. Okay, I don't need to be making a bunch of noise with that. So 
That's cool. That is the 1 in 36 Master Chase, the 1 in 36 uh, Roger Delgado Master. Very, very nice. Very cool. So, okay, cool. So I'll have to look at about picking up the TARDIS Chase. Very neat. All right, so cool. We've got the Master Chase figure there, who is very nice. Okay, so let's see who else we guess we get. So this was originally called the Master Collection, and I think the idea was to do uh, different versions of the Master in here from throughout the run of the series. And I guess for whatever reason, they weren't able to do it. So they decided to kind of do this, re change the name to the Renegade Collection and put it out like this instead. Whoop. Okay, Jenny does not come with any sort of accessory. I just want to make sure I don't miss anything. Uh, so she's, that's an interesting ratio, five and 36. So in some cases, I guess there'll be three and some there'll be two. I don't know. So, but we'll see more of her. So this is a cool figure. It's nice that Jenny, the doctor's daughter, is added to the Titans range. Pretty neat. Uh, for those that don't know, a bit of trivia, this character is played by Georgia Moffat. I think her first name's Georgia. Um, she's the daughter of Peter, Peter Davison, whose real last name I think is Moffat. Um, she's the daughter of Peter Davison, who played the fifth Doctor, and in real life, she married David Tennant, who plays the 10th Doctor. So she's uh, got Doctor Who in her blood, which is pretty neat. So anyway, and I think they met on the set of this episode. So there you go. So cool. Very cool. We've got her there. I really like this Roger Delgado figure. I can't get over it. I keep looking at it. The Jenny one is pretty cool, too. But I love that we got the old master in there. All right. So, let's see who else is in here. Oh, we got Van Gogh. Looks like you can tell by his giant hat there. And that's a pretty good likeness of the actor that played him. I don't know the actor's name. And he comes with... Oh, I would have thought it would come with a paintbrush, but I guess that makes sense. He came with a canvas there. Okay. Oh. Let's see. That fitness, yeah, he's got a little canvas. I don't think that's how you hold it, but whatever, we'll keep it in his hand for now. Cool. So Van Gogh is 2 in 18. I don't think any of these are a 1 in 18, so I think we may just wind up with doubles of all of them. Who knows? So, but that's cool. So we've got Van Gogh added. And let's see who else we get. And again, this is an interesting set because it's kind of from all over the place here. And I like that they went ahead and did a set of the fan-requested characters. I appreciate that. Oh, this we've got. Whoa, who, oh, we've got another Van Gogh. Oh, and he, for some reason, came with two canvases. So, all right, whatever. And we've got him in there. Okay. Well, I've got an extra canvas if anybody loses one. <laughs> we can hang on to it. Okay, so we'll put him aside. All right. So I am sure sometime next year we'll see a 13th Doctor set. It hasn't been announced. Um, and there's also an Alien set and a Cartoon Network set that I haven't gotten yet, but I plan on getting those soon, and I'll be able to unbox those for you too. So hold tight. And I'll get those. Oh, we've got Professor Richard Lazarus from the Lazarus Experiment. He's 2 and 18. Another cool character to add. He does not come with any sort of accessory. Another cool character to add to the Titans range. And another good likeness. Um, isn't this, um... Why can't I think of his name? It escapes me. Oh, the actor. Oh, oh I can't think of his name. The actor that plays um, Sherlock's brother on Sherlock. Uh, he's written for Doctor Who for a long time. Oh, the name is right on the tip of my tongue. I can't, I can't think of his name. I'm blanking. As soon as I turn this video off, I'm going to remember who it is. But isn't that who plays this? That's, that's who it looks like. Oh, I can't think of his name. He's been on Doctor Who too. He was in the 
Twice Upon a Time, the last 12th Doctor episode, he was in it. Oh, I can't think of his name. Okay. So anyway. Oh, we've got another Jenny. Okay. Oh, Professor Lazarus is 2 and 18. Of course, Jenny, we already saw. She's 5 and 36. So there she is. Okay, we'll keep moving because we saw Jenny already. Okay. And is this another double or is this... Okay, yeah, we got another Jenny. So Jenny uh, is pretty easy to find here. It looks like she's the most common figure along with Wilf. Oh, good. So maybe we'll get a few Wilfs in here too. Let's find out. Okay. Oh, we've got... All right, we got another Professor Richard Lazarus there. Okay. And let's keep going. Let's see if we can get some figures we don't have yet. We still are looking for Wilf, the Master, the 10th and the 11th Doctor. Ah, we got Wilf. That's awesome. There he is with a big old smile on his face. I love it. It looks just like him. Uh, Bernard Cribbins, is that his name? The actor that plays him? I might be wrong about that. Tear me apart in the comments if I'm wrong. Um, but there he is. Very cool. One of the coolest characters. One of the most popular characters from Doctor Who. I love that we got a Wilf figure. Of course, Donna Noble's grandfather. Uh, I love that he's got the big smile on his face. This is a cool character. This and the Master are the two that I'm most excited about getting in this set. Uh, well worth the price of admission to add a Wilf and a Master to my collection. So, there we go. Very cool. And let's see. What else have we got? Oh, we got another Wilf. So Wilf is 5 and 36. So him and Jenny, like I said, are the more common ones. But that's cool because everybody should have a Wilf in their collection there. So there he is. He's someone I'd like to see return to the show. They generally don't do that, bring back the older companions. But I wouldn't mind seeing Wilf again. I don't think anybody would. He was, he was pretty cool. All right, we have got... Oh, we've got the 11th Doctor in his white tux and bow tie here from Knight and the Doctor. Um, so there we go. I think uh, running out of these 10th and 11th Doctor variants to do, but they are, of course, two of the most popular Doctors, so I'm sure we're going to keep seeing more and more of these. Uh, there he is. Okay. And so he's 2 and 18 as well. So this might be another 11th Doctor right next to him here. Oh no, it's the 10th Doctor right next to him. And this is... <laughs> I do like this one. This is from the girl in the fireplace with the tie on his head. And uh, a glass of wine there. It's pretty cool. Oh, can't get it open. There it is. I'm trying to get this out so we can put it in his hand so he can take a look at it. Very cool. There he is. The drunk doctor. Well, not really drunk, but... This is an E10th Doctor variant, I have to say. Very cool. All right, so he is also 2 and 18. Uh, you can hang out here in front of one of the Jennies there. Hang out next to your wife there, David. All right, so... Who else we got? So we must have, I got four figures left. This one doesn't want to open. I'm going to get probably two masters and another 10th and another 11th. That's my guess. We've got, yep, we've got another 10th. Okay, cool. Put him aside. We've got, let's see.
Oh, yeah, we got the Master. Very cool. We got the Roger Delgado Master. He comes with... Oh, he come... Yeah, he's got his... Oh, boy, I forget what they called it. I don't think it's his sonic screwdriver. He had, like, this weird... Whatever they call it. I forget, but... Still pretty cool. All right. Very cool. We've got the Master and we've got Wilf. There he is. I forget how he even holds this thing. Does it go that way? I think so. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't remember, but very cool. Awesome likeness of Roger Delgado, the original master. Made his debut during the third Doctor's run. Very nice. Very cool figure. And like I said before, this and Wilf, my favorite figures in the set. Very neat. And that's it. That's the set. But you know what? I've got... Ah, oh, well, they fell over. They always fall over. I've got two more to open up. Let's open those up real quick. They're probably doubles. Maybe I'll get lucky and get something unexpected, like the TARDIS variant. Although, somehow I doubt it. And let's see. Yep, we've got another Master. Let's get his accessory out of there before I forget. And so who's this last one going to be? What do you think? Doesn't feel like a TARDIS. It is... Dun, dun, dun. Yep, the other 11th Doctor figure. Oh, it's a rare uh, backwards... Ver no, I'm just kidding. His head is on backwards. There he is. Okay, so cool. All right, well, that's the set there, and I've got them all except the TARDIS variant, but that's okay. I expected to only get one variant in here, but I got the cool Master Chase figure. So there he is. Very nice. Uh, I really like this set. I think this is cool. Uh, definitely check this out. Like I said, there's some fan favorite characters in here. I appreciate that Titans put this set out, uh, even though it was a smaller set, to at least get these figures into the hands of collectors. So I do appreciate that. It's a neat set. So check them out. Uh, check out my other videos as well. Also, I'm putting the call out there. If you've got one of those rare, uh, super rare Sarah Jane figures, and you're looking to get rid of it, talk to me. Please send me a message. I'm interested. Uh, is the super rare Sarah Jean in a white dress. Not the regular Sarah Jean uh, in just her regular, I think it's a red outfit. That That is easy to come by. I've got that. But if you got the rare, super rare Sarah Jean in a white dress, I'm, I'm pleading with you. Let me know. Uh, but other than that, guys, thank you so much for watching this. Check out my other videos. I've got a Doctor Who playlist that this will be a part of. So check out the other cool Doctor Who Titans figures, um, as well as my other cool Titan figures unboxings. And I hope you like and subscribe and share. And I thank you so much for watching. Keep on collecting.